Okay, welcome back. Um, I just want to show you, here's the gun now, and I've actually put a bit of detail on it. I just wanted to show you it. Now that's what we're going to be trying to achieve, putting these maps on it. Uh, it's quite easy, you already laid out the wireframe version, so now I'm going to show you the Photoshop um, version of this file and what I've done. I'm also going to put the I'm also going to put this file, the Photoshop file, up on the website, which I'll give you the address for. I'm just going to open up my colour map now. So I've opened this up. This is basically what I've done. Here it is. So you can see my overlay is my background. So basically, try and copy this, create your own designs using the template, um, use my uh, Photoshop file if you like, whip some, you'll have to change uh, the position and you have to resize some of the elements, but I've broken them all down into the different colors, so it'll be quite easy for you to just take these out and whip them in if you want to use these, or better still, create your own. When you output it, make sure you turn the background layer off and then go to save as and then save it as color map um, tiff dot tiff in your source images folder and then once you're up here then just uh, select the rendering so select the object and then render it as a Lambert and go into the color checker there go into file into the folder source images and color map and open that up and then you'll get what we've got here so have a play around with that again have a look at this the Photoshop file that I've created um, I'm going to upload that and that will be in the folders let's just flick it up now you can see whereabouts I'm going to put it So that would be in imagination zone dot net. And then where have I put these files? Let me just locate it for you. So it's in imaginationzone.net tutorials copy this. I'll just put that in there now. So okay. Here we go. So the URL you want is www.imaginationzone.net forward slash tutorials forward slash Maya 10 underscore project one underscore IBM forward slash and in there although I haven't put it up there yet there will be the uh, color map dot PSD file that you can open in Photoshop I'll also include the TIFF up there as well um, but it won't match your UV layout so you'll have to probably use the Photoshop file um, and overlay it and scale the bits if you want to use my files. If you don't want to use my files and you want to create your own, that's great. Okay, so in the next lesson we'll look at um, uh, we'll look at bump mapping, and I'm basically just going to open a new project and just show you um, how bump mapping works, and then we'll apply that to the gun as a final stage.